Hey guys, so today I wanted to do a quick comparison video between the Workos DL02, which I got pretty recently, and the Sofern SD06. I reviewed this last month, I believe, and these are essentially different versions, almost from an alternate reality, different versions of the same flashlight. And as a lot of you guys know, Workos and Sofern are manufactured out of the same factory, so there are going to be some similarities, but one thing I really like with Workos is that they do put a unique spin on their lights, you know, and one of the big things here you can see already is the general design, you know, it's a little bit, you know, the DL02 doesn't have any knurling, but the, you know, the end tail cap, it's pretty much that same large lanyard hole, the LED is pretty much the same, SFT70, with a smooth reflector, no changes to the bezel diameter as well. I do think that the SD06 is a bit brighter though, just given that when I tested out the throw figures on my Oppo Lightmaster Pro, it was able to throw another 30 meters compared to the DL02, and I test the lights in the same, same conditions as well. One of the big differences, and the reason why I I think if I had to choose, I'd prefer the DL02 is just because you have this one step access here to the highest mode. So you can see that's like the third mode, which is basically high. Got one step there. Whereas with the Sofa and SD06, you got to turn on the flashlight and cycle through to that top mode. Unless of course you, uh, you turn it on like that and leave it on memory mode on the high mode. But yeah, the SD06 has this interesting lockout function. So you basically, you see here now it's, it's on unlock, but you can actually move the switch to the right-hand side like that so that you've locked the flashlight. There isn't a way to do this on the DL02. So, you know, if you're storing this thing in your pocket, you really want to unscrew that battery tube to make sure it doesn't switch on automatically. You know, if you're using this for diving, you know, that, that issue is pretty much mute because you're going to know if it's on or not in the water when you're using it but yeah i mean apart from those differences really you know they are quite similar overall like i said if you're using it as an edc light and you want access to that one step you know one step high mode for self-defense reasons or otherwise you know that's a great feature to have whereas with the sd06 i think there's more likelihood that you're not going to be able to switch this thing on at the time that you need it if you're using it you know as an edc flashlight so it's locked here and you need to unlock it but at the same time i feel that this one here would just be you know i just feel more safe carrying this one around in the pocket because you do have that lockout mode i can also unscrew the light just to double make sure you know make sure and yeah whereas the dl02 you really have to unscrew that battery tube so initially i thought when i was reviewing the dl02 that the bezel was sealed in so this was just a one large machined piece of metal but looking at it a bit closer you can actually see underneath that bezel it's difficult to see here on camera but it has an unscrewable part as well but yeah you know workhouse and so and keep these lights the the parts glued in because this does need to withstand that 100 meters you know has to hold up to that 100 meters water resistance so it makes sense why they've glued it down but let's have a look at the beam shots and we'll see how they perform together. I'm going to compare the Workos DL02 and the Sofern SD06. DL02 on the left, SD06 on the right and look I mean side by side they do look very similar which is no surprise same reflector same LED But let's see how it goes after a bit of time. How they both go. Okay, but so far, I mean, I can't say one is brighter than the other, really. They, yeah, very similar. I mean, even, actually, probably the SD06 is just a touch, maybe a touch brighter. Yeah, maybe just a, a little bit, this one here on the right. Or I might be imagining things. There's a fine, kind of mist in the air at the moment as well so it's picking up some of that mist both of the heads are getting warmer 
now. I mean, technically the SD06 is supposed to be a little brighter, maybe a couple hundred lumens brighter. But, um, yeah. I think they've both, they are both starting to step down a little bit. Let's run this past the two minute point and see what happens. But, yeah, you can see here DL02, Workos DL02 to the left, SD06, Sofern SD06 to the right. I mean, they're pretty much, pretty much on par, aren't they? And... Yeah, I mean, if... I would say perhaps the the SD06 is just a little bit producing a tiny bit more light. I can barely see a difference though, but it should technically be producing a little bit more light according to the specs. But standing out here, I, I really can't I really can't spot the difference. You know, both of them look <laughs> pretty much identical to me. So I guess, for, you know, for you guys, it just comes down to the, the UI. You know, what's, which UI you prefer. And, you know, with the, with the DL02, obviously you got the one-step access to, to high. SD06, you don't. Unless, of course, you turn it off, get it to memorize high, and then turn it back on. But it's not a fail-safe thing in case you leave it on the wrong mode. Okay, I mean, it looks like both have pretty much stepped down to what they're gonna step down to. They both have a, have a boost driver in there as well, so there's regulated output. I mean, even at this point, when, they're, when they've stepped down, this is more than enough. I mean, this is more than enough light. Okay, let's compare just in that field, DL02, SD06. You just can't tell the difference, can you? Well, there's the answer.